Next thing I'm going to show you here with Google Sites is something that's that's really fun and cool to do. And you can see I've already added a couple of these. What I'm going to show you is how to add animated pictures to your website. Here's an animated picture, and here's another animated picture. And you can see there's room here for you to add uh, uh, two more to this website, uh, along with uh, on all of these pages, you can add pictures to those as well. So uh, here is where you're going to go. Uh, the website I'm going to take you to first is, is known as a free website. It's called bestanimations.com. And, and I'll just type this in up here so you can see how I spell it out here. www.bestanimations with an S dot com. And, and uh, this website is all copyright free pictures. You can see it says free animations, which means they are free for you to use for your website. And, uh, and there's over 3,000 pictures here that you can put onto your page. For example... If I want to get a computer picture to put on my website, I can come over here and click on computers. And let's just say I want this picture right here. Now, uh, in order to add this to your website, you got to do a little trick here. You got to hold down your control key on your keyboard and click on the picture. Same thing as doing a right click on a, on a, on a PC computer. When I hold down the control key and click on that picture, this little menu pops up. And I want to select on open image in new window. And once I select open image in new window, it gives me this website up here that ends in .gif. It's very important it ends in .gif or .jpg in order for this picture to work on your website. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight this right now, and I'm just going to copy this website. So I'm going to go to Edit Copy. And by the way, there's a little picture of the uh, uh, image there. And now I'm going to go back to my I'm going to go back to my uh, uh, Google Sites page. And right here where it says add image, first I need to go up here. If you're not currently on this edit, I'm going to edit this page. And when I go to this edit, I'm going to highlight where it says add image here. And I'm just going to go up here and I'm going to say insert image. And once I go to insert image, it says upload an image. Now if you had something saved to your desktop or your documents folder, you could, you could select that and you could upload it that way. But in order to get this picture actually moving from this best animations website, i got to click on web address. And then right here where it says image URL, I'm just going to go up here and I'm going to go to edit, paste, or command V as some of you know. And as soon as I paste that in there, you should see that picture and it should be moving there. And then you come down here and you select OK. And now that picture is there. And by the way, you can do some different formatting things here. You could left align it, center align, right align. Uh, you can make the picture smaller. Or, or medium or large or the original. I always keep it on the original because that's the one that's the least distorted. Uh, it's not. If you go large, it makes it pixelated. So uh, keep it on the original is your best bet. And here's some other in, in, things like with text wrap and that thing. Uh, but once I have that, I don't. I don't want to click this X. If I click this X, it's going to remove it. So I'm just going to simply click off of that. And now I have added that picture to my web page. And uh, if I go up here and save that. That will now be part of my website, and you can see you got an animated picture built into your website there. So that's how you add pictures. Pretty simple. Um, there's another way to add pictures too, and that is going to Google Images. Now uh, you got to be really careful when you go to Google Images because a lot of pictures on Google Images um, are not free. Uh, for example, if I want to get a picture of a football, and I just type in football here and hit return, and then I go to Google Images right there. It's going to pop up a whole bunch of pictures of footballs. But a lot of these pictures are right here are not free pictures. So I need to uh, set it up so it will search for copyright free pictures. So I'm going to go to the search settings. And it pops up with this right here. And I'm going to scroll down here. And I am going to uh, find this hopefully. Let me back up here, step here. When I click on options, I'm going to go to advanced search. My bad. I'm going to go to advanced search. And when I click on advanced search here, I'm going to scroll down. And I am going to change it to usage rights, free to use or share. So I'm going to change this to free to use or share. And I'm going to click advanced search. And now any of these pictures that pop up here are pictures that I can put on my website. They're free. They're copyright free pictures and uh, and they are free for me to use. So if I want to copy this now, I can just uh, drag this to my desktop, which I'm going to do at this point. I'm just going to drag and drop this over there. And it's called images.jpg. 
Now I'm going to go back here and I'm going to edit my page one last time here. This time when I go to add an image here, I'm going to select upload an image. I'm going to click upload image. I'm going to locate my desktop and it is called images.jpeg there. I'm going to say choose. It's going to upload that a second and I'm going to say OK. And now I have that picture. Again, I could make it smaller, medium, or large, but again, I'm just going to keep it on the original one. And I'm going to click off of that, and I'm going to save that. Actually, I maybe want to change this to a smaller image so it fits in that box there. So I just clicked on small there. I'm going to click off that. I'm going to save that. And I have added not only a picture from Best Animations, but a copyright-free picture from Google Images. If you get any pictures off Google Images, make sure they're copyright-free. Otherwise, use a free website like that, bestanimations.com. And that is how you add a picture to your website.